This is a production of the Your State Ministry of Information and Civic Orientation. The Sheimak Day administration has not been known for downsizing or sacking the state workforce since 2019 when it came into power. Rather, improving the welfare of civil servants, including reabsorption of workers who were wrongfully dismissed, has been part of his prime policies. The Oyo State Commissioner for Information and Civic Orientation, Prince Dotun Ilade, stated this during the official commissioning of Wells Radio 89.3 FM along Olioli Extension, Ibadan. Prince Oyelade, who described broadcast radio industry as one of the fastest growing industries in Nigeria, attributed the astronomical growth of radio stations in Oyo State in the past four years to the investment friendly policy of the Shehimakinde administration. Radio owners and managers will do well to imbibe this Governor Shehimakinde welfare mentality. Speaking on the making of Wells Radio 89.3 FM, which started as Wells Online Radio exactly six years ago on the 1st of January 2018, the Chief Executive Officer and founder of Wells Radio, Evangelist Lillian Bademosi, who started a broadcasting journey in 1979 with the Broadcasting Corporation of Ohio State, BCOS, and has now become the first female radio station owner in Ohio State, said she decided to establish the radio station for the broadcast of awesome content to contribute to nation's development. So each time we tell our children in school, mind what you listen to on social media. Just don't listen to any kind of junk. Don't listen to any kind of music. And see the children looking at you. It's like, okay, we shouldn't watch this. We shouldn't listen to this. So what else should we be watching? What should we be listening to? What is the alternative? So we have come to answer that question. That World Radio 89.3 will be the preferred radio station, a family radio station. Bringing home some content. That's our DNA. You can go out and leave the radio station with your child. Your child can be alone and you don't have to worry. Mm. Nothing obscene, nothing vulgar, nothing that will not glorify God mm. will come out of this thing. In his address, the former Nigerian ambassador to the Philippines, Dr. Emi Farumbi, who is also the chairman board of West Radio 89.3 FM, called on the National Broadcasting Commission, NBC, for a review in the allocation of radio frequencies across Nigeria to ensure the survival of private radio stations and LD competition in the industry. Considering the broadcasting trend among contemporary radio stations, Dr. Farumbi expressed his confidence that Wells Radio will make a difference in the industry for a positive transformation of Nigeria. We are here gathered today to commission a radio station that will be a peak. It might be the lonely voice in the wilderness. It will speak the truth to the high and the low. I don't tell you to celebrate excellence. It will tell you how well to do it. It will not celebrate the humanities that are celebrated. The event was attended by dignitaries, including a prominent Nollywood actor, Chief Akin Lewis, veteran broadcasters in the radio and television industry, among others. Benga Deshui, reporting for Alore News.